WSM, a world-renowned radio station known for its country music, is credited with having one of the tallest radio towers in America. The tower, built in 1932, had the tallest antenna in North America until its size was reduced the following year. Still, at 808 feet tall, it's one of the tallest in the nation. Content director J. Patrick Tinnell explains the significance of the tower. As WSM grew and its programming grew in popularity, an idea came up to expand the broadcast to 50,000 watts. And that would make WSM at the time what was called a clear channel station. Now clear channel, well, for a while, was like a brand name in radio. But at the time, it had a significant, significant meeting with the Federal Communications Commission, meaning that that station that was granted that status was free and clear to broadcast at 50,000 watts. And at that time, that meant based in Nashville with the tower that was to be built south of Nashville, you could hear WSM across the country in parts of Canada and in parts of Mexico. WSM premiered their most famous country music show, the Grand Ole Opry, in 1925, with the 5,000th show airing just last week. The tower helped with the station's fame, and it has the ability to broadcast to 40 states. We still use it today. I mean, you know, we still broadcast at 650 kilohertz on the AM uh, band. At the time when that tower was constructed and what WSM was doing from a, a technological standpoint was very groundbreaking, we're found ourselves in a similar situation where we're using digital media, uh, streaming, on-demand content to kind of grow our listing audience. The tower also played a vital role in World War II and was used to broadcast messages to submarines if communication was lost between the coast. The significance of that tower goes through World War II when, you know, um, clearly before the internet, before cable television, um, radio was the prime source that people got information. And uh, a lot of World War II coverage came through that tower. The radio station reaches hundreds of thousands of fans each day with the help of this historic tower. Avery Allen, WBHS 9.